UK's Minister for Africa, Henry Bellingham, is in the country. As a diplomatic crowd packed by allegations that the David Cameron-led government was pushing for the indictment of President Mwai Kibaki over the 2008 post-poll violence continues to brew. In a dossier leaked by Yata MP Charles Kilonzo and his counterpart Adan Dwale, which also alleged plans to push for a Raila presidency and have Eldoret North MP William Ruto and Deputy Prime Minister Uhuru Kenyatta charges of crimes against humanity in relation to the post poll violence, Bellingham dismissed the leaked documents as fake. My visit is to discuss the many shared interests between U the UK and Kenya, as well as regional interests such as Somalia. The visit has been planned for several months now. It was never in response to the alleged documents presented in Parliament. <clears throat> but documents are not genuine. In fact, they seem malicious. Bellingham sought to clear the air that they were not supporting any presidential candidate. The UK has no interest in any particular outcome in the general election and isn't backing any particular candidates or parties. We are and will remain non-partisan. Bellingham earlier met with Wetangula on his last day as the Minister for Foreign Affairs. He's also said to meet him again as the Minister for Trade and the Ministers for Immigration, Energy and the Attorney General. Emily Kimani, K24 This Morning.